I really like Abigail Breslin, and there's a very strong chance that the 2008 film definitely maybe was the first of hers that I saw. Not 100% certain, but if that is right, it's a pretty good one to start with. It's an absolutely delightful film written and directed by Adam Brooks, released in 2008, and of course starring Breslin alongside Ryan Reynolds. And this has a really interesting narrative and approach to storytelling, and I think that's one of the reasons why it works so well. So the description from IMDb reads as follows. A political consultant tries to explain his impending divorce and past relationships to his 11-year-old daughter. That is, of course, Ryan Reynolds' the father and uh, the father, Will. And Abigail Breslin is the daughter, Maya. And obviously that sounds quite hard-hitting and it sounds like it could be quite depressing if a father's talking to his 11-year-old child about a divorce. But actually, it's not. It is actually a rom-com. And basically, it's the story of how her parents met. You know, it's Maya wants to know about how her parents actually met and fell in love. But obviously, to get to that point, Will has to kind of discuss all of the fluff that goes around it and events that came before it involving past girlfriends. That eventually led him to meeting her mother. And you can tell that he is trying to tell a child-friendly version of this story. And... It's really interesting. Normally I don't like films that involve too many flashbacks. You know, I like things to move forward. I like narratives to propel towards where they're going. But with this one, the past is very much key to the narrative. And I think the execution of that works really well without feeling feeling like we're not gaining momentum. And I guess the main reason for that is because we are traveling towards a destination. And that is something that we don't know. And that is how the parents met. And... I think that they've handled this really well. In terms of the characters, really likeable. Ryan Reynolds is obviously really good in this. Uh, I don't think I've seen him in anything that he hasn't kind of delivered a quality performance in. And the on-screen chemistry between Will and his daughter Maya, I think, works really well. It's a lovely, sweet film. They could have just done this without the storytelling aspect of the father telling a daughter about how he met her mother great tv show but it just gives it that little bit something extra the story itself is interesting it's fascinating it carries itself really well and the characters are likable when they need to be liked and you know frustrating when you find they're getting in the way and just everything seems to gel well together it's not the most you know technically advanced it's not you know screaming cgi and everything it's very much this is a man this is his daughter He's going to tell her a story and it works really well and it's beautiful to watch. Maybe it's informative if you have children who have asked about how they met, how you met their mother or father. Maybe you could take some pointers from this. I don't know. From the description, sounds like it could be depressing, but actually it's not. It's inspiring. It's heartwarming. I really like it. If you haven't seen it, give it a go. It's it's a bit more special than your average rom-com and... I have to say, I can't fault it. Definitely, maybe, certainly do like it a lot.